Hey guys, welcome back to another tutorial. In today's tutorial, we are making a Discord. First, we go to Discord Developer Portal and open that. You might have to log in, but then you have to press Applications. Press your application. We go to then you create a bot, name it whatever you want. We agree to the terms. Once we agree to the terms, we can customize our bot however you want. So once we've customized our bot, we can go into bot here. Let's add bot. Yes, do it. This changes your application into a bot, which means that it can be a user bot. Now we accept all of these except from this one. Not turn on this one. We turn these three on. I say. Now I can go into auth two and URL general. Press bot administrator. Then we get this link. You can copy it, go here, put it here. So whenever you get a bot, you can add it to a server, as you might see with other bots like Me6 or Dino. So we do this, then I am human, and then it's on. So now we go back into the bot, roll up, reset token, copy this. Never give this token to someone else, because they can access your bot with it. Then we go onto this website called Replit and can create an account with Replit. So press sign up, put in your username, put in your email, and put in your password. Now that you've made your account, press create. And we create a Python file, and you can name this whatever you want. I'm going to call it YouTube Bot. Create this, then we can finally start. So remember that token from before? We need to convert it else. So this is secrets. If you click on this padlock icon on the left, you'll get a secret. Name this token. Add the value to your token. Then and press insert and then insert. Make sure that this is after this and then we've imported our token. We name this the token so then it's easier for us to remember. And then we can start getting going. First, we're going to do import Discord. And we're going to use Discord as an import. We're going to go intent equals Discord dot intent dot all. And we're going to go uh, from dot end import then we're going to put load in the dot so this is importing of end or load dot end we're going to go load dot end put brackets there so then that's loaded we're going to go dot equals and then we're going to go Oh wait, first we need to put a simple import. We need to put from discord.ext import and then we're going to put and we're going to go what equals commands dot pop and then we'll go commands command prefix and then this will equal your prefix we'll just put a dot here we'll do intent equal intent then once we do that we can go on here and we do dot dot and can just simply put one okay uh, if you go into Discord and you go into the server that you selected, we go into here, we press one. And to add all of these beforehand, these add all of them. And we can see we've done an error here. Is to change this to an equal. 
obviously this isn't going to work because we've And if you ever get a large amount of error here, it is just because many people are using Replit. So you might have to come back in a certain amount of time. It, it can either be five minutes or a couple hours. So we just wait for that time and then once it's ready, we'll come back. So after Waiting for a bit, if we now press one, it should appear here with discord.gb, discord.gb. We go into our server. Yeah, it says YouTube bot. So it shows that it's online. So once we've done that, we can finally start um, running commands. We do at, and then we do bot, bot, event. And once we've done that, we can do async there then we can put on message. so whenever someone sends a message it, uh, this will happen so first we're going to do if message dot content dot starts with then we do dot ping we do message dot panel dot send and then we just send wrong. Now, if we were to restart it and say dot ping, one error here, on we're going to put a wait. If you don't put a wait, it doesn't. Now, do dot ping, and as you can see, it said pong. So if we say dot ping again, dot pong. So that's how to set up a basic ping command. If you wanted something more complicated like a um, coin, so if we do lf message dot content dot start with, then we do dot coin or dot flip. We do await. First, we need to figure out if we want it to be head or tail. So we'll do import random. So we'll do number equals random dot rand int between zero and if number one, then we'll do await message dot channel dot send. It flips the heads, and if it doesn't land on heads, then we'll do elif number equals equals zero. Await message dot channel dot send. It flips tails. Put an exclamation mark, and that's we run it, and we just do dot flip. It flipped heads, flip. It flipped tails, dot flip. It flipped heads, flip. It flipped tails. Yep, yeah, keep on doing this. And every now and again, you'll get two in a row. And that's how to make a simple Discord bot in Python. So I use Replit, as you can see at the top. Yeah.